Let's go to my office and not waste any more time. Until you got home, he wants you to light the volcano. What volcano? <laughs> Look. Wow. Here, show Daddy. Oh, really? Blow. Blow. Oh, one second. One second. Ah. Woo! <laughs> Give me a second. Let me answer. Oh, honey, if okay. it's from the office, don't take it's, it. It's Camilla, probably inviting us to the dinner party with Carlito. Oh, Jules. Cami, Mariana said if you're not calling to invite her, then don't bother calling at all. Julian, listen to me, please. Cami, you okay? I need you to come to the office. I found something. It's it's really bad. <sighs> hold on, hold on. I don't understand. What's going on? You okay? I can't talk right now. Come here. I'm in the office. Okay, okay. Wait for me there. I'm on my way. I have to go. She sounds worried. What do you mean? Shh, 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 shh. <laughs> Call you later. I'm sorry. Great job in the volcano, son. Honey, is everything okay? Yeah, I think so. Mm. Call you later. Mm, will you call me? Love you. Bye. Uh, but not with your <sighs> wife watching us, Ricardo. Oh, oh, it doesn't matter. No, no, it matters, Ricardo. Wait. <laughs> Give me 10 minutes, okay? I'll meet you at the same place on the corner. Don't let anyone see you. All right, how's our village coming along? Okay. So in order for the volcano to explode, you have to blow hard through here. But let's wait for my dad.
Officer, officer. I can't give you any information. I've asked no. you three times no. who's in charge here. I work here. Somebody called me to come here. Just a second, sir. Ricardo. Ricardo, what's going on? Something happened inside the comp. Sir, your name? Ricardo Cordilla. Did something happen? Come this way. Restrepo. But what happened, Lieutenant? Say something, please. Let me through. Lieutenant! Jules! Jules! My love! Jules! What happened? What happened here? It's Camilla. Let me through! It's my wife! <sighs> civil engineer and project manager. I supervise and inspect the construction works that Hydrospheres does. Give us a wide and detailed version of everything that happened. Well, I, I got home and received a call on my cell phone. It was Camilla. She was concerned. She said that she needed to tell me something really serious and wanted me to come back to the office. I asked you to find out who was the rat who was dealing with a double accounting not to kill my wife, you imbecile! How should I have known she's your wife? Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you tell me? Why'd you kill her? I just told you I saw a man murder Camilla. Why are you still interrogating me instead of being out there looking for him? She was gonna expose everything you were doing in the company. Camilla is dead, and Julian saw you do it! That's no problem. The only thing that'll save us is if the police think Julian did it. Left side. say Julian killed Camilla. That's absurd. Because they found him with a gun and his fingerprints all over the place. Camilla was on the floor and there was nobody else there. Do you understand? But he didn't do it. He didn't do it. He saw the person who did it. Yes. And there's one more person who saw the man too. Exactly. When that person shows up, Julian will be out of here immediately. Don't worry. to implicate Julian in the embezzlement. Take care of the witness. Do you know where she may be? No, I don't know. The weird thing is, you're the second person to come looking for her. And who else is there? That man that just walked out? to the witness's house, and the old ladies left. No, Scar. Find her. Find her however you can. That woman is on the loose. We're screwed, do you understand? Don't worry. I'll find her wherever she is. I have to prepare for Camilla's funeral. And visit Julian to avoid suspicions. It's all good. How long are they going to keep me here? Julian, you're not going to like what I have to say. Just say it. The witness is nowhere to be found. None of us can find her. The police or the investigation group, nobody. The police she is are nowhere. asleep. The murderer is still out there. There were three shots, Patricia. How I did know. they justify that? They say you shot Camilla first but didn't hit her. 
Julian, then you ran to Ricardo's office and that's where you caught her. Right. And that's all they need to keep me in here. And they caught you with a gun, with the fingerprints all over the gun, with the body, and now... And now the prosecutor has a motive. A what? A motive. And what motive could I possibly have? The double accounting. M a what? In your computer. That is enough reason for you to want to kill Camilla. No, because listen to me. She knew what listen to me for a second. What double crossing? What the hell are you talking about? I do field work. I know, Julian, but you manage budgets. You, you manage the contracts, the materials, everything. You get it? I can't believe it, Patricia. No. I'd never do something like that. You know it. I'd never do a thing like that. I know, I know. But you must understand. There can only be one thing that counts here. It's the evidence. With the motive. It's a closed case. You must understand. No, 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 listen to you me. You must... Listen to me. This is a trap. Somebody's trying to screw me over and they're gonna do it with me as a motive. But who, Julian? Who, who wants to screw you in this way? Who? Who? I don't know. I don't know. We have to find out. And the witness has to show up too. Until then, what? Well, since the prosecutor's office is so sure of the case they have, the next step is... The trial. Wait, what do you mean? The trial? This is a nightmare. It's all a nightmare. I know you didn't do it. What's the matter with Patricia, Julian? Why hasn't she got you out? They're waiting for the witness to show up. There's something else I need to tell you. I don't even know how. The police found some type of double accounting on my hydrosphere files. What? Ricardo. Somebody's stealing inside the company. That's why they killed Camilla. Camilla somehow found out about it. That's why they killed her. You have to believe me. You believe me, right? Of course, Julian. <sighs> I know it wasn't your fault. I believe you. Well, the next step is the trial. I need a favor, please. And it's very important to me. Take care of my family, okay? Make sure they're okay. Samuel's birthday is in a few months, and I promised him I'd get him that. That remote control Julian. car. You need Julian. to get that for him, okay? Julian. Julian, it's not gonna happen. You're gonna be with your son on his birthday. I'm sure I won't be there. Yes, you will. I know I won't. And we're gonna celebrate because this whole nightmare is gonna be over, okay? I swear, Julia. I swear that I'm gonna find the bastard who's doing this to us, I swear. I'm going to investigate. I'm gonna make him pay, I swear. I'm at the prosecutor's waiting for the verdict. I don't know. Let's hope we get sentenced today. This court, and according to the faculties the law gives me resolves. First, to sentence the accused, Julian Duarte Ortega, of known civil and personal conditions in files, for being found as the perpetrator responsible for the crime of homicide in conspiracy with aggravated robbery, to 26 years in prison, 2,000 monthly legal minimum wages as a fine, and 160 months of disqualification for the exercise of public <laughs> rights and functions. This can't be happening, can't. This can't be happening, Patricia. Can't. It's false evidence. It's natural. Second, deny the conditional suspense of the execution of his sentence and house arrest for Julian Duarte Ortega. Take it. It's incredible. It's incredible. Say goodbye to my son. Tammy. Hey. Loot. Are we going home now? No. No, my son. I can't. Dad has to go on a trip. Again? Yeah, again. But listen, listen to me carefully, Sammy. I want you to behave, okay? <laughs> Listen to your mother. 
Always listen to mom, okay? And remember, I'm always thinking about you, okay? Can I come with you? No, you can't. You can't. But when I come back, we'll go on a trip together, okay? To see the volcanoes? Yes. To see the volcano. Just a second. Just a second. I love you. I love you. It's okay. Everything's gonna be okay. It's okay. I love you. <laughs> Here's the list of things we keep in custody until you leave the prison. This is the number of your cell. I'm sorry, but I'm missing the most important thing. A picture of my son. We keep that my in wife here. called and she said that I can take it. The picture. Nothing I can do. Look, I know my rights, sir, and I want the picture, okay? Give me the picture, sir! Look, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Really. Please. Thank you. Sign here. Deaf or what? I said take off your clothes because I already sold them. If you're deaf, then you don't need your ears. I'm not deaf. And I've already rented out that mattress.
everybody, on the line, quickly. We don't have much time. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, hey, man, how much longer? Straight ahead, straight ahead, straight ahead. We're gonna make you look pretty. You're too muddy. Uh, tough with him. All right, really clean. Plumber. You know they call you plumber now, because you fixed the pipes. Plumber. Oh. All right, move it, move it. Wake up, and close that. Shower can't hurt close us. that. Close it. Oh, look, there's the woman's pavilion. You see? Oh, look. Close it up. You know, this was mixed. They're so ugly. Woohoo! Move. Okay, sit in my seat. Move. Get moving. Although that skinny one is really pretty, right? Is she looking at you or is she looking at me? <laughs> She's really pretty. Really beautiful, right? The only good thing here. them for you. But don't worry, we'll come to an arrangement later. You'll give me some incentive. Here you go. Put them on quickly. Mariana? <laughs> what happened to you? I'm fine, I'm fine. Why are you so barefoot? I swear. You okay? You okay? Mm -hmm, yeah. How's Samuel? He's fine. Does he ask about me? All day long. Did you tell him I love him? <laughs> he made this for you. He wants you to see it and finish it. I told him I'd mail it to you. <laughs> I don't want you to bring Sammy here. Why not? Don't bring him here. I can't let him see me like this. So what Please. then? We miss you. He can't see him like this. I'm dying to hold him, but he can't see me in here, okay? Please. <laughs> Listen, Patricia's gonna find that witness for the appeal. Look, we have to keep our hopes up, okay? Is that for yeah. sure? Tell okay. Sammy I'm on the trip, will you? Okay, okay I'll tell him. You look so beautiful. It's good to see you. <laughs> you look beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> my dad coming? No, baby, because your father's traveling and he's, he's really far away. In Japan. He's in Japan. Do you know where that is? Far away. So far that when it's daytime here, it's nighttime there. Can you imagine? Go to sleep now, okay? You have to behave really well, just like your father has. Okay, Robinson, go ahead. Okay. Hey, yep. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Mister, how are you? I'm fine, thanks.
Lanyard! What is it? Get up, I have a job for you. Where? Get up, come on. Come on, move it. I need you to fix the leak. Can you do it? Yes, of course I can. But I need tools. You think these are enough for you? Yes, that's fine. I'm gonna smoke a cigarette because I can't stand the smell of shit. But I hope this is repaired when I get back, okay? All right. They've taken in that hole. Uh, we're attacking Sierra. Munoz! The food for this piece of shit Spaniard! Let's go. Uh, uh, Be careful there. It's my dad. No, Sammy. It's my dad. Happy birthday, champion. Oh, no, sir, the salute. The no, sir, the salute. Come on. Come on. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. Well, finally, he had a great time. However, he asked about his dad when he went to bed, and Julie, he doesn't want me to take him there. Well, I agree with that. Prison is no place for a child. I know, but I just feel really bad lying to him and telling him that his father's on a trip. And you? Are you still waiting? Are your hopes still up? We're talking 20 years, Marie. What do you want me to do? Forget about him? Well, the truth is, there may be nothing you can do about it. Mariana, I don't want to cause you any trouble, really. I don't want you to worry more than you already have. But the investigation I started in Hydrospheres didn't have any results. There is nobody we can blame for doing double accounting. Do you understand? Ricardo, are you trying to tell me that Julian did it? That Julian killed Camila? He's not a murderer, Ricardo! You know no, him! No, I thought I knew him! But the investigation isn't showing us anything! What do you want me to do? I have to believe them! Camila discovered him! She discovered the theft! She discovered the missing money! She confronted him! They argued! I'm sure he attacked her. She tried to run away and, and they made it to her? my office! Oh, Ricardo, please, let's just say Julie made a mistake. No, 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 this wasn't a mistake, it's a theft! It's a theft that Julian trying to cover up killed my wife. You understand? He killed Camilla! <laughs> you need to admit that if the prosecutor sentenced him to 20 years, it's because they had enough evidence. Mm -mm. Now listen mm -mm. to me. If you want to keep on blindly believing, then you can do it.
Get a plumber. You have no idea what kind of trouble you're in. You got him with Sierra, huh? You screwed him up. Move it. Outside. Outside, plumber. Look, look. There's your hero. And he looks skinny. How long is he in there for? About three weeks. They beat him up pretty bad, right? Nobody's been in there for so long. Of course, he messed with Sierra, so... What did he expect? Hey. Hey. Huh? Call his friend. For you. Here you go. Julian is still locked up, and the bills just don't stop coming. And we still haven't paid for Samuel's school. I can't pay you back yet. Don't worry about that. You don't have savings, and I don't have any money at all. <laughs> what to do? It's so strange. Julian has always been careful with money. We just bought this really expensive house, and, and I've never worked. Patty, I need you to tell me the truth. Is Julian going to be able to get out of prison if the witness doesn't show up? I'm working on his appeal, okay? And how long is that going to take? Well, it's more or less one or two years. I'm trying to figure out some issues, but I got them under control. What is it, Mariana? Tell me. Nothing, baby. Don't worry. Just tell me. Uh, thanks for the house, Sammy's school. Do you need money or what? I'm looking for a job. No, but why? I asked Patricia to help you. Yes. Yeah, she's been helping us. But it's not enough anyways. We could, we could always sell the house. No, the house is for you and Samuel, baby. Don't sell the house, okay? And Ricardo, is he making sure you're okay? Why hasn't he come to see me? Baby, Ricardo's going, he's going through a really bad morning period for Camila. It's been really hard for all of us, but tell me about okay, you. but tell him to come see me. Of course. I missed you so bad. Oh, Sammy, how's my boy? He okay? He okay? He's, yeah, he's, he's fine. He's, it's just that I don't know what to tell him anymore. He doesn't believe that you're on a trip anymore. He doesn't. 
Maybe just tell him the truth. The truth? Yeah. Tell him what happened. I'm gonna be locked up in here for a while. I wanna tell him. Tell him, okay? Do you want me to bring Sammy here? There's no other choice. Don't you want me to see him? Hey, do you want me to ever see myself again? He, he has to know that I'm locked up in here. Tell him I'm innocent, okay? Tell him everything. Honey, he's too young to no, understand no, these things. No, then, he's just then I'll, he's I'll tell him. I'll tell him part of it. I just need to okay, see okay, him. I'll That's all. Him please. Me. I can't go on like this if I don't see my son. I'm begging you. Please. 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 Yeah. Okay, I'll bring him. The next time I come, okay? These are the ones. Ricardo. Please send them for me. Hello. What are you doing here? I came to say hello. We haven't seen each other in a while since Sammy's birthday. Yes, you're right. Let's go to my office. Sure. Go ahead. Julian is your husband. It's natural for you to defend him. I just came back from seeing him. And now he wants me to take Sammy there. No, Julian is crazy. How can you even think about doing that? But he's his son and he wants to see him. Yes, but you're the mom. Mariana, you know what's best and seriously, taking him to prison, surrounded by murderers, <sighs> doesn't sound like the right thing to do. Listen, Marie, you came here for advice, right? Well, my advice is for you to stop this. If you're not thinking about you, Think about Samuel, your son. Hey, look who's over there. The plumber. I'm gonna go talk to him. No, have you gone mad? You're not gonna survive in here alone. What? You have to make friends with the leader. Plumber, get up. What for? That's an order. You shouldn't be on the patio. Why not, Look, I'm not gonna get into trouble with Sierra because okay, of you. Okay, get up, get fine, up. Fine, fine. Go. Let's go. Thor. Forgive me for interrupting your reading of the fairy tale. Let's go, Spaniard. I need you for the usual job. Go ahead. Hey, gentlemen. I'm gonna smoke a cigarette and do my round. I hope it's done when I'm back. Yes, sir. I'm counting on it. Katana's past the salt. Of I got it for you. Hold it down. Ah, jeez. Ah, jeez. Ah, you Ah, jeez. Ah, jeez. Ah, Ah, You're starting shit! The pipe. The pipe broke, sir. Don't make me take you to the dungeon. Don't make yes. me put you in the hole, okay? Yeah, yeah, sure. All right. <sighs> What's going on? What's going on?
Women always think you have to wait for them, right? You expecting your wife? One of them. Small and tight one. She makes the best tamales. You want me to save one for you? Or do you only eat caviar, lobster? All those weird things that rich people eat? Eh. Go ahead, man. And the book is there. And where's Samuel? Is he upstairs? Uh, they let him in? Is he okay? Tell me, what happened? Calm down, no, I need to... answer me. Is he okay? No, Julian, he's not okay. What? What happened? He's not fine, and I'm not fine. I've made a decision. I've been letting these people rub their hands all all over my body when I come here, letting these perverts look at me all the way they do. I'm not coming back, and I'm not putting my son through this at all. Do you hear me? Your son is also my son, Mariana. Our son. He's our son. Look, I know you're having a hard time, okay? But I have every right in the world to see him. Why don't you think of him? Stop thinking of yourself. I've never stopped thinking about him. I'm not going to behave in front of Sammy like a guilty man. Are you doubting me? Look me in the eye and tell me I'm guilty. Look me in the eye and tell me that I'm a murderer. You're my wife. If you think that of me, what do the rest think? Is that the person you think I am? A psychopath murderer who's capable of killing his best friend's wife? I'm not coming back. You're not coming back. I can't be married to you can't anymore. Can't be married to me anymore. Leave. I, I leave. Uh, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'm sorry. Sorry. Really. I have every right to see my son. I have to protect him from what you did. This is all your fault, Julian. Accept it. I have the right to see my son. Bring me my son. Mariana. Calm down, Marie. Mariana, look at me. Mariana, everything's gonna be fine. This was only okay. Relax. It's Dad. Daddy! Hey, my beautiful boy. I missed you. How are you? Okay? Fine. When are you coming back home? Well, not yet. I can't come back just yet, but how's school? Are you being good? Yeah, fine. That's good. That's good, son. Sammy! It's Daddy! It's Daddy, Mom! It's... No, no! Give him back! Sammy? No, no, Sammy! Sammy? Wife can't deny you the right to see her son, brother. No way, man. We should send somebody to rape her. If she's complaining too much, we'll kill her. Spaniard! <laughs> I have good news. Apparently you have lots of requests. Come with me. Where are we going? That's none of your business. No. It won't hurt. Go and fix Gutierrez's pipes. Come on. <laughs> You're gonna have to take advantage of the fact that Sierra's not here.
I called you because I wanted to know who you were. You and I never get the chance to talk. I saw you fighting with your wife. Ex-wife. She won't even let me talk to my son. I'm losing my mind. I know how that feels. I have a little girl, Michaela. Although she's already a teenager. She's 17. This is my son, Samuel. He's so cute. This is my daughter, Michaela. This is how old she was the last time I saw her. Is her father doing the same to you Mariana's doing to me? No. She lives with her father's sister, and she never wanted to bring her here. Why isn't she living with her dad? Because her father is dead. And you miss him, of course. No, not at all. Esperanza, forgive me for asking this, but why are you here? I killed my daughter's father. I found him raping my little girl and I killed him. And how much longer do you have in here? I still have ten more years. The only thing I want to do is get out of here and talk to my daughter. I still need to explain to her why. Why I did what I did. <laughs> but I'm probably going to get out. She won't even recognize me. this notebook when my daughter was a little girl she used to love me to tell her stories about tall pink birds and all sorts of animals you know flamingos yes and I've been writing here everything that's been happening over the years I would like for you to correct it so there are no spelling mistakes. I don't want my little girl to think I'm stupid or ignorant. Correct it. Of course. Of course, I'll help you. Mariana's doing whatever the hell she wants while I'm locked in here. Patricia, how much more injustice do I have to endure to see my son? We have to do something. Please, I have to see him. It's not a good time to start a legal process. Mariana is negative towards anything right now. What, what, what did she say to you? That she doesn't want Samuel to come to the prison. And we can't force her. That she wants to take the custody of your son from you. And she hasn't answered the phone since then. We have to have faith the appeal will work out. That's gonna be two years. If something goes wrong, I'll never see Samuel till he's after 30. I need you to be strong, okay? I need you to be positive. 
Do you know what George's enemy is in here? The illusion that you're gonna get out soon. I don't want to feel that way again. I don't want you spending your life chasing something that won't happen. I won't let it. Guard. Several welcome pastries, huh? Calm down, calm down. You know that I need to ask to caress you. Be careful. However, listen, you're gonna take this off very soon. It's it was courtesy of your boyfriend, I'll have to charge him for it, huh? If you mess with Julian, I'll finish you. What are you gonna do? You're so stupid, aren't you? I wanted this to be the easy way. But we're gonna have to do it the hard way. Because you need to start understanding that you're gonna be mine and your little boyfriend will have to answer because he almost screwed my arm forever. Over my dead body. Are you okay? Sierra is back. Yeah. Did he hurt you? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Are you okay? Julian, that animal is going to torture us with threats. But we can't let our guard down, okay? If we do, we're done. I'm not as strong as you are. Do you know why we continue to be alive? Hmm? Because we have children that we want to hold on to. And that's the biggest strength of all. The biggest... de CMO Producciones para Caracol Televisión Internacional.